Hello everyone, Michael here from Trading Institutional Order Flow um, on the Forex Factory thread. It's been a few days, I thought I'd make a quick video um, whilst I have the time. Um, again, for those of you who don't know, this is where we hang out, this is where we play, this is where we share ideas on the Forex Factory website. Um, the thread is called Trading Institutional Order Flow. And what we're looking at is to build a community of like-minded traders, trading supply and demand, and changing lives. That's what we're in the business of doing. Well, actually, we're not in the business. I'm just a trader myself. Um, but helping as many people as I can, I hope. All right, so if you want to join the chat, if you want to hang out with us, ask a question, post a chart based on the supply and demand methodology that you use. Um, feel free to join us. We share ideas here on an ongoing basis. Um, hang out with us. Um, today I just wanted to make a quick video on, on an opportunity I spoke with one of my friends about recently and one that could still potentially come up in the next week and it's um, on the New Zealand CAD. So very quickly as always we start from the top down and we go looking for the big imbalances in price so here we go as we can see on this pair we have an overriding supply zone there that's been tested multiple times and it's still holding um, demand so far that's been held has been down here um, and we recently as as i think a few weeks back now a few months back we formed a buying area here which as you can see is held up price so we're back up into this area where there has been um, a loss of selling in the past. It's it's an area where we definitely do not want to be doing any buying. Um, if it is going to break, so be it. But we'll we'll wait to see if that happens. For now, selling is the higher probability trade. So here's what I was telling to my guys that this area obviously was formed um, up in here. As you can see, my cursor moving. This is where it is. When you look down and, and and look at this on a smaller time frame to actually see what price is doing this is all about the fractality of price which i always talk about in the methodology excuse me if you can hear a bit of a party in the background there are some parties going on around here at the moment so you'll hear it going on so what we what we said was we had broken um the momentum on this time frame leaving behind um, a supply zone that we we were looking to short at um, and this I, I showed this to to one of my friends recently and that's that's where the trade was now realistically speaking not being greedy or anything your initial profit margin would have to be around here and even before price gets there you can see there's been movement but with the fractality of price again when you go down to the 240 minute chart you can see that we we now have created another supply zone um, and you can see on the weekly here that we've taken out this bit of buying which took out this bit of selling um, so possibility to get short up in here is not looking too bad remember this may fail it may not but who cares we're looking at the opportunities and we're taking them as they happen so this is the area that i wanted to point out to you guys very quickly in this short video going forward um, it may be a trace that suits you i'm not saying go out and sell it i'm just pointing out what i see um, so that's a potential trade coming up possibly next week if price rallies it may continue to fall from here um, so that's that's just what I wanted to point out what I was looking at this evening just to share with you guys stay safe out there guys keep it safe keep it simple join the chat when you can all right speak to you all soon have a great week